All right, movie review time again. And I watched the new movie, Hunt for Jesus, Save Your Soul. I actually watched it on Peacock because it was released day and date on streaming and in the theater, just like Warner Brothers did last year with their slate of movies. This is considered more of a, a mockumentary or a, a satire, maybe a, a religious satire, or at least a satire of, let's just say, the uh, mega churches that are existent, uh, existing around the world. So it's certainly not for everybody. Um, it did score fairly low from audiences, so I, I don't know if that played a part or if they just thought they were seeing something totally different. Um, in terms of these types of movies, these mockumentaries, things of that nature, um, I would probably lump it in with like, trying to be like, this is Spinal Tap, things like that. This is Spinal Tap is way better than this movie. It's kind of middle of the pack. It did have some laughs. I'm not sure if it was really trying to be uh, a comedy per se. Um, I, I think it was trying to make some uh, some points. I'm not sure how how well they were actually made. I will say I did like the acting. The two lead actors, I thought, uh, did very well in their roles. Um, you know, it's it would probably be better to catch it on streaming than I think pay for uh even a matinee ticket. You know, if you're interested in it, I would catch it on streaming and not pay uh, your full ticket price or even a reduced price. So I would give it about three out of five. Like I said, it's about middle of the pack. Um, wait, or not say wait, go ahead and catch it on streaming. If you want to watch it, that's gonna be the best way, I think.